road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Oh, what you say? Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Oh, woman, oh, woman, don't you treat me so mean. You're the meanest old woman that I've ever seen. I guess if you say so. Pack my things and go That's right, hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more Oh, what you say? Come on back nicer greetings from handicapped people whose spaces I park in. <laughs> Look, honey, I think we need some us time, hmm? How about we go same place together? Maybe one of those trendy little coffee shops where we can drink cappuccino and rap. <laughs> we'll make fun of the old people. You know the ones who order regular coffee. <laughs> when coffee shops are out, all the old people started going, thinking they were cool. The new in place is... Never mind. No, it's nothing personal. It's just that only complete terminal gorks want to spend time with their mother. Hey, Mom. Want to do something? I'm busy. Why don't you walk the dogs? And don't forget to kick the poop into the neighbor's ivy where they won't find it until the kids have an Easter egg hunt. I'll hold the leash. You kick. No way. I'm wearing my good shoes. I'll pick it up with my hands, but... You're wise beyond your years. Thank God we got rid of them. Now we can get back to our plans. Mom, please, no kid in their right mind wants to spend time with their parents. I mean, how much time do you spend with your parents? Oh, pshaw. They're just not cool like me. Come on, honey, let's macarena. <laughs> Mom, that dance is so old, they're doing it on TV shows. Daddy, Daddy, teach me Charleston again. Okay, honey. <laughs> Just remember, bend the knees, stay relaxed, and let the hands do the jiving. <laughs> oh, I just love the Charleston. You know, you can make anything uncool. You always used to say I was bitching. You still are. Daddy, I'm so glad you're home. I've had a problem, and I've had no one to talk to. My hair is drab and lifeless. It's not responding to my shampoo. Hmm. Yes. You have a soap residue and your pH balance is off. Not so. I would recommend a clarifying shampoo, a heated protein pack, and a fresh lemon rinse. Oh, thanks, Daddy. <laughs> Wait a minute. He's just blathering something he heard on a TV commercial. He doesn't even know what a pH balance is. Oh, yeah? Feel his hair. Soft. <laughs> Surprisingly soft. What's your secret? Beer! <laughs> Inside and out. In fact, I'm soaking in it right now. Oh, say, look at the time. I guess I better go get myself another treatment. <laughs> hey, Dad. Look, the dogs are constipated, and we really don't have anything to do. You want to do something with us? Dad isn't home yet. <laughs> oh. exactly like Dad. <laughs> Come on, if that was Dad, he'd be holding a beer. <laughs> oh, what's the matter, Mom? Was that another hot flash? Another? <laughs> I have never had a hot flash, damn you! Or a mood swing. Oh, why don't you like me? <laughs> why don't you need me? Do you realize you've never even once said, I love you, Mom? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess some things are just better left unsaid. You're right there, Mom. Oh, you know, I forgot something. <laughs> I love you, honey. I love you, Daddy. <laughs> oh, come on, honey. Let's have a special Mother-Daughter's Day, please. I just bought this wonderful new day planner. 
Please let me write something in here besides set clocks forward and buy a new day planner. Please, please, please. Fine, Mother. We can get together tonight. Tonight? Ooh, let's see if I'm free. <laughs> well, I do have something planned, but I can move it. Oh, Mom, that's so sweet. You don't have to move your period for me. <laughs> N43. I-22. Bingo! So this is where you go for excitement, huh, Mom? Hey, don't knock it. It's better than sex. At least here I stand a chance of being the first one to yell bingo. No, it's, it's really nice. I think it's great the way they got all of these corpses to sit up. <laughs> now, honey, the old have many things to tell us. I used to look like you. Ah! <laughs> and for a while, I looked like you. Ah! <laughs> Get your dabbers ready. New game, new game. It's not cancerous, it's B9. Kill me. <laughs> Sixteen. Hey, Mom, can we go to the recycling center after this? Oh, 70. No wonder CBS's numbers are down. All their viewers are here. G-52. Bingo. Bingo, bingo, bingo! You know, Jack, I've been thinking. I'm breaking up with Drew Barrymore. I thought you loved her. Love is a two-way street, Jack, and I'm alone in my truck. <laughs> How many times must I send her letters, bearing my soul, saying the three little words every woman wants to hear? Dance for me. <laughs> I thought the three words were, I have cash. Well, I'm sick of her rejection. She's not the only star worth stalking. I'm going to make the little vixen jealous. When they know another chick is interested, all of a sudden, they straighten up and fly right. Take a letter, Jack. Yeah, all right. Dear Alicia Silverstone, I love you. You don't know me, but I know everything about you. Where you live, where you eat, where you sleep. But don't worry, I'm not like the others. Restraining orders mean nothing to me. <laughs> I'm dumping Drew Barrymore for you. So put on your red dress and your spike heels and bring it on over to Papa. <laughs> Drew, if you're watching, Safa! <laughs> Next time you'll dance the dance, baby. Isn't Alicia a little chubby for you? She won't be when I'm finished with her. <laughs> Dad, we're hungry. Who cares? So's 99% of the rest of the world. <laughs> Tonight, I'm taking Tiffany to that new Italian place. No, you're not. She's with Mom. It's Pingo, Dad. She's got it bad. And that ain't good. <laughs> the fourth night in a row. I've lost my little girl. My baby. I'm all alone. There's no point in going on anymore. Why, oh, why didn't I have more children? <laughs> what are you two doing here? Looking at you just reminds me that you're not her. How do you think that makes us feel, Dad? Ah, you're right, son. You're absolutely right. I'm sorry. I was being so insensitive. I'm sure you must miss her, too. <laughs> She's not dead, Dad. She's just with Mom. Same thing, son. Believe me, I know. <laughs> So tonight, we'll start a bingo hopping at the Lutheran Church. Where's my baby? Where's my little girl? Honey, big news. There's a sale at the House of Cashmere. Let's go tonight. Oh, Cashmere. They're giving out bumper stickers that say, bingo players, do it in church. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I've got to get one. Look, I'm begging you. Come with me. We can go to the Armani Express. I went and stole money from the used car lot. We could go for a cappuccino afterwards. B-I-N-G-O, 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 and bingo is our game -o. <laughs> Jack, honey, 
I need to tell you something. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Tiffany likes me better. I'm the best child's favorite. I'm the best child's favorite. She doesn't love you. It's that old demon bingo would got a hold on her. Look, Jenny, I've never asked you for much. Well, I have, but you never gave me anything. I never deny you anything. You do, too. Do not. Do, too. I do not. You just don't verbalize. You just sulk. For once, just tell me what it is you want. Well, back rub would be nice. Okay. Knock yourself out. Uh, I'm talking about I want a back rub. No! You hurt my feelings when you said I never give you anything. Oh, all right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. There, does that, does that relax the hump, huh? <laughs> is the big deal, you big crybaby. So I'm taking Tiffany out, so what? You're not just taking her out. You're taking her away from me. You may find this hard to believe, but in that cold outside world, I'm pretty much a nobody. You lie. <laughs> honey. Oh, honey, you're a used car salesman. You sell the car to the woman who cleans the house of the man who may someday find a cure for heart disease. So indirectly, sweetheart, you're responsible for saving people's lives. Do you really think so? No! <laughs> but, sweetheart, you are great in bed. Yeah, I am, aren't I? No! <laughs> I'm just trying to soften the blow because Tiffany likes me better. <laughs> Tiffany likes me better. Don't you understand? I need Tiffany. She's the only person in this world who thinks I'm someone special, who looks up to me, who thinks I'm great. Oh, sweetheart. I think you're great. You do? No! <laughs> but Jack, come on, you still have the boys. Mom, you can torture Daddy anytime you want, but Bingo waits for no man. Gotta go, honey. Don't wait up. B-I-N-G-O, B-I-N-G-O, B-I-N-G-O. And I just washed my hair today, and nobody noticed. <laughs> Honey, we're an hour early. I know, I just don't want some fat, gimpy woman to sit in my lucky seat. <sighs> the smell of stale cigarettes, Ben Gay and Geritol. It smells like, well, like a Rolling Stones concert. <laughs> oh, Mom, I feel like I fit in here, God help me. Hallelujah, I just love it so. <laughs> Mom, I'm gonna quit school, cash in my college fund and become a bingo babe. I just know I can make a living playing bingo. Oh, honey, I know it looks glamorous, but the bingo life is a hard one. <laughs> you know how many kids quit school each year and try to go pro. What if you don't make it? What if you end up playing for Cupid dolls and goldfish at some Utah country fair? <laughs> I know, Mom, I just, I don't want to wake up one day a famous neurologist and wonder what could have been. <laughs> honey, do you love me? I love that you introduced me to bingo. Hey, guys! Want to spend some time with your old dad, huh? What's the matter, Dad? Is your beloved Tiffany playing bingo again? I'm happy she went. You hear me? I'm happy, because this gives us boys a chance to bond, huh? Come on, let's sit down over here. Right. Tell me, guys, what do you think? Think your dad looks handsome today, huh? Just wash my hair, it's nice and soft. Go ahead, feel. <laughs> feel it, Ross. No, you feel it. All right, but you gotta do whatever comes next. <laughs> okay, I'll feel it. <laughs> hey, it is soft. <laughs> Can I feel? <laughs> wow. It is soft. Hey, Dad, how can we get hair like yours? Yeah, I don't want my hair gummed up. You weren't just eating anything, were you? No. Just cleaning out the cat box. Get out of my hair! <laughs> All right, let's, let's just talk, okay? Now, uh, what's Ryan. your name again? Ryan. Ryan, Ryan. yeah, that's right. <laughs> so, uh, tell me, Ryan, um, what's your favorite color? Blue. Oh. Blue? Yeah. Tiffany's is green. Who cares? <laughs> you 
Now, what's your favorite color? Green. Uh -huh. Green. What shade of green? <laughs> well? Your hair is soft, Dad. We're not playing that. We're playing colors now. Oh, forget about it, son. This isn't working out. Let's just watch some TV. What do you feel like watching? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Anything. When's mommy going to be home? Nah, come on. <laughs> Don't be silly. This isn't a test or anything. Just say what you feel like watching. Football? Wrong! <laughs> Soft. Green. Mower's place? Good. <laughs> now let's get back to your sister Tiffany's favorite program. Who's that redhead? Is she the crazy one or is she the other one who tried to run the guy over? You know, or is she the crazy sister of the other one? You know, the one who was married to the guy who used to be married to the crazy one? Pull it together, Dad. We're not Tiffany. We can't take her place. You have to realize we are who we are and respect that. Wake up, man. Accept what you cannot change. Enjoy your sons, your boys, your guys. Dig me? <laughs> yes, son, I do. And of course, you're absolutely right. Now, for the last time, who is that redhead? Uh, uh, Ryan likes blue. Huh? <laughs> well, I guess now it's just you and me, blue boy. <laughs> I can't understand a word he says. Well, put in your teeth for God's sake! Hey, I've got Pino. What you've got is a learning disability. I do? What I win? What I win? A free ride from the state. Are you sure you guys wouldn't be happier at home with Daddy? Green. Not blue. I hate blue. Doesn't it feel soft? It's the beer wrench, you know. You, uh, you want to go out shopping? Jack, it's not going to work. I'm not Tiffany or our 40 year old accountant going to Woodstock 3. Drew or Alicia, if you're watching, I'm straight. <laughs> and if RuPaul is watching, this is how you carry it off, baby. Floppy, you're supposed to be talking to me. I'm the one with the problem. Yeah, no kidding. Ah, this isn't working. Give me this. <laughs> Might as well just own up to the fact that I've lost my little girl. My sons are strangely fearful. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah. Oh, well. You got Jenny pregnant, and there goes your future. Oh, well. You have one kid you can't afford, but the wife wants two more. Oh, well. They bring Cosby back with a new show with the same old wife. Oh, well. When does it end? When does oh, well turn into oh, hell? What does it take to make you mad? A woman president? We've already got one. <laughs> Jack, you're an important guy. You sell used cars to the maid of the guy who may cure heart disease. You matter, Jack. Really? No. <laughs> you have nothing. Nothing but your daughter's love. And Jenny took it. She stole Tiffany from you, plain and simple. Let's face it, Jack. She stole your life, your dreams, and 85% of your closet. <laughs> and all of the good flannel shirts. Oh, how I love those flannel shirts. They were so soft and comfy. Kind of like my hair. Go ahead, feel it. Uh, very soft, Jack. Can I smell it? Sure, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> What you have to go and do that for, Mr. Floppy? I'm allergic to kitty litter. Oh. <laughs> Look, Jack, you lost everything else to Jenny. Make a stand with
with your daughter. Win her back! By God, I'll do it. I'll show Jenny who's boss, and I'm gonna start by taking all of my flannel shirts out of her closet and hide them somewhere real good. <laughs> the only thing is, I can't let her see me wearing them. I got it. I'll wear them under other shirts. <laughs> You're the man! I'm the flannel man! I'm the other shirt man! I'm the man who hears the bunny talk man! Yeah, the cuckoo man! Yeah, the crazy man! I'm crazy, man! <laughs> It's almost time for bingo. Jack, have you seen Tiffany? No, no, I haven't. I, I just don't understand it. Where could she be? How could she miss bingo? How could she miss being with me? We were starting to get so close. She was finally starting to look up to me. Oh. She made me feel like I was someone special. Well, I think you're somebody special. Really? No. <laughs> I had her. What could he have to offer her that's more powerful than bingo? Come on, heart eight. Eight! I won again. <laughs> oh, isn't it nice being back with your daddy again? Yeah, it's great, Dad. <laughs> Soft daddy. Oh, uh, my baby's back. This lovey dovey stuff has got me hot. Which one of you is single? <laughs> Dear Mr. Floppy, we've noticed you made several derogatory comments about thieving gypsies in your recent shows. Clearly, you've chosen to pick on us because we're not as well organized as the other stupid minorities. Well, that's all changed. Sign, the Committee for Concerned Thieving Gypsies. Uh, thieving gypsies, let me put it this way. We won't say any derogatory things about you if, uh, you give us back our wallets. Oh, yeah, um, and our children. <laughs>